Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, Indian School of Physics, guys, this is Nathan here and today I have come with a very important problem and uh, it's a tough nut, it's time of collision between the two particles due to their mutual gravitation. So here I'm presenting another alternate uh, way which lead us to the same answer compared to the traditional one which is uh, force uh, and integration method. So here is the problem statement two point masses m1 and m2 are placed at a distance of r0 from each other the masses are released from rest and uh, are allowed to collide find the time after which these two masses will collide with each other assume that the masses are moving under the effect of mutual gravitation only so this is the situation given and once we release these masses so concept wise we can see these two masses are going to collide at the location of center of mass this is the first uh, observation we will make so very easily we can say m1 r1 is equal to m2 r2 and r1 plus r2 is r0 so from here we will get the value of uh, r1 as m2 r0 by m1 plus m2 or r2 value as m1 r0 by m1 plus m2 now here the trick part is actually i am uh, <coughs> going to make some uh, assumption here comparison as well so i'll just uh, tell you how this trick is uh, applied here we already know the time taken by the particle moving in elliptical path around a fixed mass right and we know it depends only on the major axis so entire time period is 2 pi under root of uh, a cube by gm where a is length of semi major axis all right so similarly here you can see uh, between these two masses if I treat it as an elliptical motion, right? Uh, by the way, here uh, we have to use uh, M effective concept here. I will explain. Uh, let's let me read this part first. So here, if we choose the ellipse having uh, zero minor axis, then this will be identical to M1 moving in straight line path. Now let's imagine a situation where particle uh, is moving in elliptical path and that elliptical path is uh, having zero minor axis. So in that case it will be like it is moving along the major axis only. Right and uh, here it is written then this will be identical to m1 moving in a straight line path. We will calculate the time taken by the particle for half of the elliptical path. So it's like uh, if it is like this and here to here. So this will become t by 2, this will become t by 2. Also we need to have a fixed mass which can create same effect on m1 as m2 will create. So I am using here some uh, mass and I don't know how much it will be. So I am calling it as m effective. Alright, this is at rest and it has to follow an elliptical path you can say. And here force is the equivalent uh, effect we can say. Uh, so the logic in this case I'm using is I'm using the boundary conditions So in order to equate that effect, I'll prefer the initial point itself So if you see at initial point if m2 is creating certain force on m1 This m equivalent also should create that similar field. So here I can write g m1 m2 by r0 square and this is g m1 m effective by r1 square so R1 we have already calculated from here we are going to get this M effective now if I further simplify this M effective comes as R1 square by R0 square times M2 so when I substitute the value I am getting this as M2 cube by M1 plus M2 whole square now let's compare this with the elliptical path so if I am having this uh, zero minor axis in that case this uh, elliptical path will pass through this point itself and uh, it will be almost like a straight line path which we are looking for because uh, zero minor axis here I have shown some uh, non-zero values but you can see and this length this will become length of uh, major axis which is 2a so 2a is equal to r1 I am writing here now I can use that uh, elliptical uh, for elliptical part time period t ellipse i'm calling is and this will become 2 pi under root of a cube by g times m effective and here m effective i have calculated already from the logics which i have explained earlier so i can say this time of collision is t ellipse by 2 
only for one side not for coming back so i can write this as pi times root of uh, r cube by 8 gm effective all right so here if i substitute the value of uh, m effective and if i substitute the value of r1 this is the working here you can uh, check this is the working here by the way this entire part so you can uh, see i have calculated the calculated the value of r1 cube by m effective only because remaining are constant so r1 cube and uh, here m effective value i can substitute if i substitute simplify i am getting this value as r not cube by m1 plus m2 and when i substitute this value in this equation i am going to get uh, t collision as pi root of r not cube by 8g times m1 plus m2 and this is going to be the final final answer for this problem i hope you have enjoyed this uh, method you can see here there is a remark also the student should remember this result and it will be very handy in solving problems with different masses and different uh, distances combination so if you remember this formula very quickly you can jump to those uh, uh, problems and you can write the answer here you can see so guys there is an offer from an academy side and uh, earlier also i have told and uh, this is uh, valid up to 11th and 12th february so Today is the last day. With three months, one month extension, you are getting with six month, three months, twelve month, three, three, three. Like this, you can check. It is the same as earlier. All right. You can uh, to know more about these uh, subscriptions. You can call this uh, given number. And uh, also about the An Academy test series is coming, and it will be test analysis class and practice sessions. And uh, these are the prices and all very affordable. I feel. and uh, you can use my code uh, nitin sir for any of these uh, <coughs> plans and the next one is uh, like i have been explaining for uh, quite some time about an academy prodigy and uh, this is happening uh, on 13th february 10 am onwards uh, here also you can enroll for free using my code nitin sir and yes it has uh, this 20 lakhs uh, 20 lakhs uh, college grant which is huge you can also appear for uh, all india mock test uh, series for jee 2022 uh, every sunday uh, 2 to 5 this exam is being conducted and it is free of cost here also to join this you can use my code nitin sir so that's it guys in this video i hope you have enjoyed it it is a slightly different method but uh, compared to the traditional one it is uh, very very easy very very handy method so try to remember this result that's it thank you thanks for watching it